Good day, this is a Slow Mo Guys video involving Pyrex. Yeah, we've got a couple of sizes here. Um, I noticed that on the warning label, yeah. it says, avoid sudden temperature changes, not for use on the stovetop. So this is Slow Mo Guys, you know that we like to ignore all warning labels and do exactly what it says not to do. We just treat them like an instruction manual on how to destroy itself. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what will make a good Slow Mo Guys video? <laughs> Ah, Just don't do, do that. <laughs> Excellent. Apparently, I read that um, Pyrex in the US is, is different in that it's slightly crapper than European Pyrex. <laughs> it's a lot crapper. Yeah. Because it's made of something called soam soda lime glass. Yeah, and not and, yeah, borosilica. Borosilica, or... which is what's in the Europe. For this video, which will hopefully be glass cracking and splitting everywhere, we need a much higher frame rate than usual. So we've bought in the big guns, the 2511. Shoots way faster. I'll start filming at 28,000 frames a second at 720p and uh, you know it's doing a lot of work because it's loud as heck. Looks a bit hot. That's an understatement. It's 38 <laughs> degrees out here. I mean, a blue rubber and flame proof suit. It's like I'm in a greenhouse. That's what happens in June in Texas. Oh, that's disgusting. <laughs> is it not July? It's July. Oh, it's July. Yeah. All right. So what we're going to do is get this blowtorch and act like it's a, a stove top, like a gas stove, heat up the Pyrex, get some ice cold water, and just dip dip, put a little bit in there, and hopefully it'll just explode in my hands. A little dip dip, dip dip, and we'll film it on this bad boy. Lads and ladies, do not try this at home. You ready? Yeah. So tell me when I'm in frame and that. Is this where I'm going to be? That's perfect there, but we yeah. can we can readjust when you're absolutely ready. Okay. okay I'm absolutely ready. Okay, let me get final folk. Okay, go for it. Oh! Jesus! It did it! Oh, <laughs> God! Pretty good. That's insane. Yeah. What frame rate is this at? 28 thou. 28 thou. That's the starting point, is it? Oh! How fast that is! Flip! That's 28,000 frames a second. It just <laughs> went straight round, didn't it? There was no messing around. That is madness! I like how I'm holding it, and then I'm suddenly holding nothing. So my <laughs> hand just goes like, whoop! That's insane. It does actually explode, sort of, doesn't it? That is cool. <sighs> to stop the glass going everywhere in the garden, I decided to put a tarpaulin down. Didn't work! The glass was so hot that it just melted straight through and went onto the grass anyway. Look at it, look at all these holes. I bet the glass didn't even notice the tarp. No. It just landed in the grass and thought, oh, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> Completely pointless. That was great. We, uh, we do need to go faster, so I'm gonna lower the res. We'll go way standard def with it. That'll give us 120,000 FPS. Ooh. Good. Meaty. 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 Okay, go. Oh, it was different completely. Was it? Look. Oh, wow. Look how slow the water's falling in. Just nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. Well, what is happening is the Pyrex is going, oh, God. <laughs> oh, whoa. <laughs> God, it's so Flip. fast. It's rapid. God. That is immensely cool. As you can see, I've sacrificed my lab coat to cool oh, the camera down. That's good of you. It's rather yeah. hot, yeah. rather hot out. I noticed in the first clip that all of this shattered pretty smoothly, all the lines, but the handle turned almost into dust. So what I want to do is go as fast as we can, really, sort of 170,000 at an acceptable resolution on just this bit so we can hopefully see that happen super duper extremo bonanza fast. Any more adjectives or? Open. 171,000 and a half frames per second. Pretty mental. That's disgusting. Tell me if I'm out of frame again. Push it. What happened? Just went. Without you even doing it? Didn't even touch it. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh my god. Were you framed up? Yeah. <laughs> Who needs water? 
That's ridiculous. I wonder if just the air cooling it down was enough to shut it out. That much? Bugger me. What happened to the handle though? Did the handle go? I, oh, the handle didn't even go. Didn't it? No. Okay, so now we're using the second one that partially smashed and uh, just focusing on the handle. And this is being filmed at 343,000 frames per second. That is insane. That is, that is absolute madness. That's a dank film rate. This is over 13,000 times slower than you can see with your own face. Did it go? I think it did, you know. It's still really hot, but look at the amount of detail and the amount of cracks that are in that. It's just completely, you can't even see, can you? What's amazing as well is the fact that it was attached to the rest of this. I just heated up this bit and only this part cracked. Yeah. Only this part went, no, I had enough. The rest of this was just like, yeah, I'm not involved in this. <laughs> I'm cool enough. I'm cool enough, I'm fine. Okay, how's this for a mental stat? The camera recorded for 5.1 seconds. Yeah and generated 19 and a half hours of footage. I think I'm gonna be sick. <laughs> <laughs> That's disgraceful. Almost a day of footage. That's vile. Do you think we should just stick it, like put it on the second channel as a whole video? Just, just the, the whole entire video? 19 hours? Would, what, I'm just put nothing in the description? <laughs> <laughs> How many people do you think would actually watch it to the point of like, where it does it, yeah. just searching through well, 19 I bet the, hours of footage. The break would be around 10 hours in probably. <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard to mentally get your head around how fast that glass is moving that I think we should do a comparison video of human reaction time. So at the exact same frame rate, I'm just gonna drop a little water in your eyeball and we'll be able to tell how quickly you react to that compared to the video we just shot of the handle breaking. Yeah? It's a great idea. I mean, it's just gonna be like looking at a picture. Yeah. So I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna go three, two, one. Yeah. Okay. So move your hand away. Yeah. All right, ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, that was it. Oh, God, <laughs> right in the eye. That was great. Oh, God, direct hit on my eyeball. <laughs> God. I think that looked really cool. Well, that was immense. I'm always blown away every time we film it. The speed that glass cracks, yeah. phenomenally fast. It's crazy, we couldn't do it without this camera, that's for sure. Couldn't do it on the old flex. What's the science behind that, do you think? It's called thermal shock, which is where a sudden temperature fluctuation in the material causes the stress. So on the glass, you've got the heat wants to expand the glass, and the sudden cold wants to contract it. So you've got two opposites, and the glass just sort of goes uh, Just gives up. up. Yeah, that's it. Bad of commitment, the old glass. Just like, I can't handle it, I'm out. <laughs> I'm done. Hopefully you enjoyed that video. That's the fastest we've ever filmed so far. Uh, I'm sure one day we'll exceed it. Uh, feel free to follow us on Twitter, subscribe. Subscribe to our second channel. We've got a lot of behind the scenes stuff on there now. It's actually some good viewing. And uh, buy some merch if you want. Sweaty t-shirts. Sweaty t-shirts. We sell ones without sweat on them. Unless you want um, the sweat. Unless you want Dan's sweat one. I want to go faster. It can't be done. It can't be done. One day. No. Do you ever stop to think that yeah, you, you can, but should you? <laughs>